Kitchen. I have a new friend for you guys to meet. Perhaps some of you have met him. This is Smayo. He's the executive chef at Crush here downtown Amarillo. That's cool. And we are so excited to have you on. You have you have a very interesting history, and I'm so excited to have you in our kitchen, but also here in our community because I hear your food is baller. Well, thank you. Thank <laughs> okay, you so, so much. Today we're going to make mussels, right? That's correct. Let's get it yes. going. All right, so what do we need to do? Uh, we're going to heat up the pan first. Okay, so. And we're going to add this one tablespoon of butter. Okay. And then we'll let them. Melt it down a little. Okay. And then we add this some leeks. So really kind of thinly shaved yes. leeks. Yes. Okay. And then we'll add some shallots. Okay. Same thing. You're thinly kind of, but you have them more like they're not chopped. They're this whole sliced. Right. Okay. Absolutely yes. And then we'll add some garlic. Okay. And the salt and pepper. This seems like something, mussels would be something that I would think would be really complicated, but these are all, I mean, it's just about having fresh ingredients. It's very really easy, so you will sweat the vegetables. Okay. And then how do you know when the vegetables are ready to and move so they forward? So they're going down, you see that it's almost ready, and then we'll add our mussels. Okay. Can you get, ac do we have access to good mussels here in our area? Yes. Yeah. Uh, I get it three times a week. We get it on Mondays and Wednesdays and Saturdays. Yeah. Seafood, yes. And if for people who haven't tried mussels, like what is the flavor you're gonna get with them? Uh, so if you didn't try the mussels, it will be like if you you know you put a wine or so mm -hmm. or tomato sauce, whatever it will take them. But it will oh, be okay. the seafood. So it's all about the sauce yes. that's with them. Absolutely. Okay. So we'll add one a cup of white wine. And when you're doing this, it doesn't do you do like a particular kind of white wine. Does that no, matter to you? No, no. it doesn't matter as long as it's white wine. Okay. All right. Yes. And you just let it kind of simmer down? And then we'll close the pan. Yes, and it will simmer down and, and let it cook about five minutes. That's it? And that's it. And then you just plate it all up? And plate it up. That's it. Okay, it's well, easy. let's chat for a little bit. Sure, so where are you from? I am originally from ex Yugoslavia. Wow. And so why yes. are you here? Uh, in Amarillo <laughs> People, or United States? No, well, in both, <laughs> I suppose. My, my, you know, my mom always says, why is he here? Or why is so-and-so here? So yeah. why am I being my mom right now? There you go. Uh, we had a war in mm -hmm. 1990s, and I was in the refugee camp for five years. Mm -hmm. And then uh, I had the option to choose to go to uh, the United States or Canada or Australia. So I chose to come to the United States. And so you came to the U.S., you went to yes. culinary school. That's right. I came to the U.S. in 1997. And I didn't speak any English. Really? <laughs> and I came as a single. My parents, I left them behind. Uh -huh. So I came by myself. And so there you go. And then I went to culinary school in Houston, married my wife, had three kids. Uh -huh. had a life. You, I've met one of your little ones, and yes. he's so fun. He's, he loves it. He's a fan of baseball. He, <laughs> he is, loves the he, dog poodles. He is. <laughs> <laughs> he's like, when are we going to go on? <laughs> no, he's like, so, so cool. Yes. Well, we're so glad you're here, and we're well, happy you're at Crush, so it's really cool. Me too. I'm glad to be here. All right. Well, we're going to finish this up. We're going to let it cook off, and then we're going to show you the finished product when we, do, when we come back, so y'all don't want to go anywhere.